the hormones testosterone and estrogen are produced naturally by the bodies of men and women. According to some research, some foods may have an impact on certain hormones levels. The body's chemical messengers are called hormones. They are crucial for libido, mood, health, fertility, and a variety of other processes. Contrary to popular belief, both male and female bodies produce estrogen. Some male health issues are correlated with high estrogen levels. In this article, we examine foods that could either increase or decrease the body's estrogen levels and examine the supporting data. High Estrogen Levels in Guys The primary female sex hormone is estrogen, whereas the primary male sex hormone is testosterone. Estrogen is present in men as well, but in lesser concentrations. A crucial aspect of male sexual health is estrogen. It helps control sperm production, erectile function, and sexual drive. Additionally, it promotes bone health. However, males who take in too much estrogen may experience issues. The following are signs of excessive estrogen in men. Low testosterone and excessive estrogen can both cause erectile dysfunction independently of one another, as can breast growth, often known as gynecomastia, difficulties getting an erection, and infertility. Additionally, several studies have connected male depression and excessive estrogen levels. For a person's general health, estrogen and testosterone must be in balance. Health problems can result from either hormone being present in either amount. Hypogonadism, or low testosterone levels, is a common age-related health issue for men. Reduced sex drive, erection issues, and a decreased sperm count are some of its symptoms. It's a common misconception that having too much estrogen leads to low testosterone. Testosterone and estrogen do not compete with one another. Can a man lower his estrogen levels? There hasn't been much investigation into the claims made by numerous websites and natural health experts that particular diets can suppress estrogen levels. According to several research, certain meals may cause estrogen levels to rise or fall. It is unknown, nevertheless, if these meals can help with the negative health impacts of elevated estrogen levels. Before adopting dietary modifications to lower estrogen, see a doctor. The healthiest diet differs depending on the individual. Foods that could decrease estrogen. According to some study, some meals may cause the body to produce less estrogen. More research is required because current research is frequently of low quality or has utilized animals rather than people. The following foods may reduce estrogen levels. Soy-based goods. Products derived from soy are particularly abundant in substances known as phytoestrogens. These substances could have estrogen-like effects on the body since they share the same chemical structure as estrogen. Products made from soy include several meat alternatives and edamame. Some studies claim that soy products might raise the body's estrogen levels, while others claim the opposite. Ironically, both are accurate. Isoflavones, a kind of phytoestrogen found in soy, are recognized as selective estrogen receptor modulators. This means that when they connect to estrogen receptors, they might have a range of consequences. They may have a pro-estrogen, anti-estrogen, or neutral impact. As a result, various isoflavone varieties may cause the body to produce more or less estrogen. Because of these variances, it can be challenging to establish generalizations regarding how foods containing phytoestrogens affect human health. Although soy offers several health advantages, According to a reliable source, additional study is required to determine how phytoestrogens and soy affect humans. For instance, studies show that phytoestrogens, especially those found in soy and legumes, may reduce the incidence of prostate cancer. Though additional research is required, it is likely that estrogen contributes to the emergence of prostate cancer. According to a 2015 scientific review conducted by Trusted Source, Soybeans may also minimize the risk of colorectal cancer by reducing estrogen levels. Cruciferous plants Indole 3 carbonyl, a substance found in cruciferous vegetables, may have anti-estrogenic properties. This implies that they might lower male estrogen levels. However, there is no conclusive evidence to support the claim that consuming cruciferous vegetables lowers estrogen levels in humans. These veggies fall into this category. Cauliflower, broccoli, and bok choy, Studies on Brussels sprouts According to a reliable source, cruciferous vegetables may reduce the risk of prostate cancer. Mushrooms Compounds in oyster mushrooms have the potential to inhibit the aromatase enzyme, which changes testosterone into estrogen. They might lessen the body's estrogen levels as a result. 
a vitamin called hispolon, which is present in some medicinal mushrooms, may also stop aromatase from working. At the same time, it might boost the estrogen-like substance estradiol. Mushrooms and estrogen levels require more study. Turmeric and curcumin Curcumin is a substance found in turmeric. 2013 research It is uncertain whether curcumin has the same impact in individuals because the researchers discovered this result in cells outside the body. Large doses of curcumin were discovered to raise testosterone levels in rats in a 2014 study trusted source. The effects of curcumin on people require more study. According to Alcohol Research Trusted Source, long-term alcohol abuse can cause reduced testosterone and higher estrogen levels. These two hormonal conditions may be a factor in erectile dysfunction. There are several effects of low testosterone that alcohol may amplify. Alcohol, for instance, has a lot of calories and might make you gain weight. Grains Due to its resemblance to estrogens that naturally present in the body, a fungus called xerolinone found in some grains has the potential to upset the balance of estrogen. More than 5,000 samples of mixed cereal were tested by researchers in Europe, where the fungus is widespread, and they discovered that 32% of the samples tested the fungus. Studies Trusted source have primarily concentrated on the chemical mechanisms and effects of xerolinone in animals. Although there is no proof that the fungus is harmful to human health, some experts speculate that it might have similar effects in people. Healthy diets include grains including barley, wheat, rice, and maize. Lentils, peanuts, and chickpeas are a few examples of the legumes that have numerous health advantages. Additionally, legumes contain phytoestrogens, especially in the form of isoflavones. According to research, the isoflavones genistein and daidzein found in yam beans may cause mice to produce more estrogen. Notably, certain isoflavones, especially those found in soy, may reduce estrogen levels. Further study in this area is recommended because isoflavones' effects on estrogen levels are anticipated to vary depending on their kind and concentration. Legumes may also help to maintain heart health and lower the chance of developing metabolic syndrome. Instead of eliminating them from your diet, think about having them sometimes in tiny portions. Additional methods to lower estrogen levels before attempting to alter these hormone levels at home, it is important to talk with a doctor if someone is worried about their levels of estrogen or testosterone. Hormone shots are advantageous for certain people. The benefits of testosterone therapy may outweigh the hazards for older males, but additional research is required. Dependable source Natural approaches to lowering estrogen have been studied in some depth. Numerous studies indicate that for certain girls, exercise may result in reduced estrogen levels. For instance, a 2015 trusted source study discovered that higher levels of aerobic exercise decreased estrogen levels in women who had a higher risk of getting breast cancer. However, there is little research done on men. Zen estrogens are chemical substances found in some goods manufactured by humans that mimic estrogen in the body. Although additional research in humans is required, some cell research indicates that exposure to these substances may increase the risk of cancer and endocrine disorders. Senestrogens are present in many polymers. It may be preferable for anyone who wants to reduce their exposure to these chemicals to stay away from plastic items like bottles and food storage containers whenever feasible. Making healthy lifestyle modifications, such as the ones listed below, may also be beneficial for men who are concerned about the effects of elevated estrogen. Consuming less calories, getting more rest, and engaging in frequent exercise. In conclusion, although important for men, estrogen might have negative effects on health. There is a limited amount of high-quality research on how different diets affect hormone levels, despite the fact that some meals can affect a person's hormone levels. A doctor can do tests to rule out a variety of explanations if a patient is worried about aging-related changes or suspects a hormonal imbalance. There are numerous therapies available. A doctor can also make tailored dietary and lifestyle suggestions.